Happy St. Patrick's Day. Good afternoon. Welcome back. It is our birthday video, and it's unfortunately going to be cardless today because uh, the few drivers that do have birthdays, I just don't have any cards of. Uh, we're going to start off with a few events, though, and I was looking down the list, and this was really, really strange. On this date, there was only two races that were held in the 1980s. Uh, one was in 1984 at Atlanta Motor Speedway. Davey Allison won the ARCA race. The following season, 1985, Bill Elliott won the Cup race at the same track, uh, suffering from a broken leg that he'd got two weeks earlier at Rockingham. So those were the only two major racing events in the world held on this date. I'm sure there were short tracks and other things going on, but as far as like big, big time racing, that's really, really weird. Uh, on this date in 1991, Johnny Andretti won his first and only kart PPG IndyCar race at Surfers Paradise Australia. On this date in 1996 at Homestead Miami Speedway, Dave Rosendi's won his first of three career truck series races. And just kind of looking down the list, a lot of short track racing, you know, the, the, the smaller touring season, the modifieds and so forth. Um, yeah, there's a few, few Bush Xfinity Series races. Last Cup race on the state was in 2019 at Auto Club. Kyle Bush won that race. So this really isn't like a, a popular date for Cup Series races to fall on. And then uh, really quickly, a couple of birthdays that we have. I don't have a date for it, or a year for it, I apologize. But Doug Rice with PRN, Performance Racing Network. And then born on this date in, I just lost it, 1929, Tiger Tom Pistone, or Pistone, depending on how you pronounce it. So, uh, wish I had some cards of those guys, unfortunately I don't. I might have a couple of Tiger Toms in the other sets, I just don't know which box that they are in at the moment. But anyway, we'll do a quick set review here while we got you uh, on the line, I guess. Uh, we'll do a real quick 2003. I don't know if we've done a set before or not. 2003 Press Pass Premium in the zone. Look at that hair on Dale Jr. Look at that haircut. So we'll show you the fronts, show you the backs real quick. Looks like the same photo shoot there. Jeff Gordon. This is a 12-card set, so this is going to go by really quick. I want to show you the front and the back. That way, if you want to hit pause, and you can read the back of every card. As you see, the cards, even though they're like hollow foil, they are themed with the driver's sponsor. With the color scheme, that is. Dale Jarrett is next. Three-time Daytona 500 winner. There's seven-time. Very young seven-time. Back when he was no-time. Matt Kenseth who would win the title in 2003, and he's smiling because he knows he's got it in the bag. A little bit more serious. Mark Martin, kind of looking a little displeased, trying to, uh, you know, brush it off because he was a five-time championship runner-up. A very young Ryan Newman, 2008 Daytona 500 winner. Very young Ryan Newman. Steve Park, who at this time was recovering from his serious crash at Darlington 2001. And, you know, they said that uh, it didn't affect his speech or anything. Go listen to some pre-crash and post-crash interviews of Steve Park. It is very, very different listening to him speak. Ricky Rudd is next. This was uh, getting close to the end of his career. Don't think he, yeah, he would not win any more races after this. His final win came in 2002. Was it at Michigan or Sonoma? Sonoma. Because he won at Michigan in 2001. So, driving for the Wood Brothers. There's Tony Stewart. A baby-faced-ish Tony Stewart. Kind of smiling for us there. A little, little bit happier times. Rusty Wallace. In our final card, Mr. Michael Waltrip, he's uh, sitting there thinking about how he's going to get away with rocket fuel and spin gate in a few years. And that's kind of his deer in the headlights look, it looks like. So anyway, 
couple cardless birthdays. Happy birthday again to Doug Rice and Pete Pistone. Um, hope they enjoy their days. Hope you guys enjoyed this little uh, set review. It's only 12 cards. I figured I'd throw it in because I like to try to show cards on the channel because that's, uh, hey, it's in our name, right? Anyway, thanks again for watching. Hope you enjoy the rest of your Friday. We'll rip something tomorrow. I don't know what we're going to rip yet. We got plenty of stuff stacked around the corner here, so we'll, we will find something. So enjoy the rest of your Friday, and we will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.